I'd like to revisit something with the Excel documents. So going back to my tax return document where I was adding the annotations, Caseware has the ability to hyperlink to specific document types. So to insert a hyperlink reference, I can use the right-click menu and choose New Hyperlink Reference. Or because I right-clicked, I can also click on the hyperlink reference on the annotation toolbar. For those of you who like to use the menus, under the Insert menu, I have New Hyperlink Reference. Now, the label is optional, but I do like to specify a label in here. So let's say I want to go to the Accounts Receivable line in an Excel document. If I leave it on hyperlink, I'd have to input a web page. The web page uh, will open when I click on the link. I can also go to a case view document, which is going to give me the options to jump to a section, a paragraph, or a cell within the case view document. I also have the option to jump into a Word document, and in a Word document, I can specify a tagged paragraph or a bookmarked paragraph. Now, in this document, I don't have any bookmarks, so none are being listed. It would just open up the document as if it were a regular document reference as opposed to the hyperlink reference functionality. And finally, with the Excel workbook option, when I click on the document dropdown, again, in the document manager, it will filter out to show me only the Excel documents that are available. Selecting the Excel document that I want and clicking on the location. Now, I only have the one tab available to me in this particular Excel document, but if you have multiple worksheets within your Excel document, it will list all of the worksheets and their names. It also gives me the option of choosing a named cell range to link to as opposed to an individual cell. So with the balance sheet selected, I choose the cell that I want, and I'm going to go with uh, D10 in this case, and click OK. And that comes up with my hyperlink. Clicking on that will then jump me into the Excel document to do the appropriate cell, in this case D10. And that's pretty close. C10 would have worked as well for me. That is the hyperlink reference. 